It's a summertime favorite. Go to the fair and two bucks will get you one. It is corn on the cob or sweet corn as American as apple pie. Meet the Combe family out of Eagle, Idaho. They grow sweet corn. Jordan and I, we've been doing it since he was five years old. He's 17 right now, so uh, I've been doing this for 45 years. And just started out with my oldest son and then my next son, and we just worked, you know, all the way down until Jordan. Corn eaters are a picky bunch. They're always looking for a more tender and sweeter variety. Combe started with Golden Jubilee tried several other varieties over the years, and finally settled on the incredible variety. What's good about it is it's really easy to pick. It's so much easier than this sugar bun. It's just like velvet when it rolls off, and they're just uniformed ears. They mature clear to the end. Son Jordan is the marketing director for the family business. We've put it on Craigslist, and uh... We've announced it at our church that we have it. We have lots of signs everywhere all down the road. And, you know, family friends know, they tell their friends. <laughs> Efforts paid off and buyers are plentiful along the road in front of the farm. Jordan also decided it was time to raise prices. Input costs are much higher in 2011. Well, I mean, everyone else is charging $4, and it's about time that we, you know, got with it. Uh, we've been $3.00 for a long time, about time that we changed. <laughs> we were losing money off it, I think. One customer, he thought it was too much, and he started for home, and then he turned around, and it was the very first day we raised the price, and he turned around and brought it back, and said that was too much. And so Jordan gladly gave his money back, and it just took off after that. We were, we were a little nervous the first day, but it, it has been nothing but good. Incredible corn, regardless of the price. If you've got a, a tender corn, people just keep coming back. In the Combe Corn Patch, for Steve Ritter, this is Jake Putnam reporting.